the last of my three best bets for today. The only question is how much do I put on each one? Hopefully go two out of three, but I'm looking at three out of three here today. As Jim Harbaugh's Michigan Wolverines steamrolled Rutgers 52-17 to last week and must be a scary sight for the 3-6 and six Nebraska Cornhuskers. It's been three straight losses for the Huskers, and Vegas certainly thinks that they are starting their fourth straight defeat in the face this week. Michigan is number three, and so clearly on a collision course with Ohio State in the last week of the season. So will Nebraska be able to play spoiler, or are they just another punching bag for the 9-0 Wolverines? Michigan is so uniquely suited to win big as a huge favorite. The Wolverines don't rely on their quarterback to heat to hit deep shots like Ohio State, who can sometimes get held down by a team like Northwestern and the weather in Illinois. Michigan just hands the ball off to Blake Quorum and punches the other team right in the mouth. Michigan has a number four rushing offense in the nation, and that is translatable against lesser Big Ten opponents. Last week against Rutgers, Quorum ran fourth 109 on 20 carries and finished with two TDs. In all, the Wolverines ran for 282 yards. Speaking of which, Nebraska's defense is 103rd in the country against the pass, and more importantly, 107th in rushing yards allowed. The Wolverines will run all over this defeated Nebraska squad that desperately needs to get this season over with and rid themselves of the stench of Scott Frost. Give me Michigan minus 30 and a half as my third and final play of the day here in NCAA College Football Week 11. What say you though? Like it? Hate it? Tail it? Fade it? Let me know. Comments below. Guys, gals, everyone, good luck to you whichever way you go. May the winner be yours. Best of luck to each and everybody. We're all here for the same reason. Get that cash. This is Trending Rabbit.